Congratulations, Selena. So here is my Selena Gomez inspired look. This video I saw a few days ago. I wouldn't have thought to see her in such a character. I mean, she's just so bad at and Selena Gomez, I adore you. I love you. I am I am a Selena Gomez fan. She's pretty awesome. I saw this um, promotional video she did for MTV because she's going to be hosting the EMAs. So anyway, I hope you guys enjoy. I'm just going to add a little bit of primer potion on my lid. And for my MAC palette, I'm going to mix soft brown and cork. and then blend it out with a blending brush. Next, I'm gonna add liquid eyeliner. And when I get to the very corner, I'm gonna fling it upwards. I'm going really dramatic with the lashes because Selena has awesome thick lashes. So all I did was layer three pairs of lashes while the glue is becoming tacky, I'm going to quickly do my brows and I'm using my Wet n Wild brow palette. I'm going to use the darkest shadow and I'm going to start in the middle and just start filling out my brows. I'm kind of going further than my natural brow, making it longer. I'm actually gonna tight line my waterline up above. Just apply your really thick lashes. Next, I'm going to contour and I'm going to use Max Shade Stir. I'm gonna contour on my cheeks and then um, like on my forehead and the temples, the usual. And then for blush, I'm going to use Neutrogena's Natural Glow. Just mixing the two colors. Cause she's kind of neutral on the cheeks. Really all the color is focused on the lips. Now for lip liner, I'm going to use Max Auburn Lip Liner. Fill in my lips with NYX Matte Lipstick in Alabama. So I noticed Selena's lips are kind of outlined with a darker color. So I am going to use a dark brown pencil and I'm just using this brow pencil brush from uh, NYX. I'm gonna gloss up my lips a little bit and finally get to use my MAC Wonder Woman lip gloss. This giant thing. Oh, holy cow. Moving on to hair, I use these hot rollers um, that I use all the time in my videos. So whatever drugstore hot rollers, I mean you don't even have to use hot rollers. I just felt like they were the easiest to use. If you have um, a curling iron or whatnot, then you can use that too. I'm just going to take a few bobby pins and the front of my hair, if you have longer bangs you can work this too. Just kind of roll it. And the reason why you want to curl your hair is so that the ends are curled as well rather than it sticking out. And then pin your curl in place. Bottom. So I just did four little rolls in the front and then I'm going to bring my hair up to a high ponytail and then just wrapping the hair around. Kind of twisting lightly and wrapping it around. Just taking bobby pins and securing the bun. I just bought this handkerchief at the, where did I get this? At the thrift store for a dollar. Just gonna fold it in half and then continue folding it. And it's gonna look like this. Tying it in the front here. I'm gonna hide the ends underneath 
the band. And just for extra security, I'm gonna bobby pin the bandana to my hair. Can't forget the huge hoop earrings. And then I got the flannel shirt from the thrift store. Um, it was just a men's size small and it was only for several dollars. So uh, that's it. Hopefully you guys enjoy it. I hope, I hope you guys aren't mad at me for doing something like this, but it's all just for fun and um, I love Selena Gomez and anything she does, I'm just like, oh, she's gorgeous. So hope you guys enjoy it. Let me know what you think and I'll talk to you later, bye. Don't forget to check out more of my videos. The one in the very top right, Benji is acting like a little silly bear in our everyday vlogs. Top left, I'm teaching you how to use hot rollers, just a hair basic. And then at the bottom, it's just an easy eyelash tutorial. I just bought this handkerchief, handkerchief, handkerchief. I just bought this handkerchief 